Cape Town-based artist is visualizing African proverbs in oil paintings. Gary Fryer uses his art as a means to highlight and create awareness of various social issues. Here's CGTN's Yolisa Njamela. Proverbs are an integral part of African culture. They use to illustrate ideas, reinforce arguments, and deliver messages of inspiration, consolation, and advice. Gary Fryer highlights all these through his work. It started almost eight years ago, I think, uh, 1999. I did a exchange with the Alliance Francaise and the people and culture. Um, it was an artist exchange. So what the organization tried to do was to find a, a theme that would match artists. So they came up with proverbs. And then they would match an African proverb with a French proverb. And then we went, I went over to France, visited a couple of places there, Paris, Brittany and um, worked on those type of... And it's got a wealth of proverbs that he illustrates from the rest of the continent. This specific proverb that's illustrated here, its origin is from uh, Kenya. Um, the proverb is, when elephants fight, it's the ground that suffers. And this is a, actually from a package crate that I appropriated and it was so well made that I thought it would work quite nicely as a, as a base for my, my painting. The idea of the proverb is that when big forces fight, it's the smaller people or the, or the smaller uh, people that are engaged that actually suffer. We all use European proverbs in our everyday speak as Africans and with Gary bringing the African proverbs to us from all over the continent has taught me and it teaches everybody who comes into our space about the African proverbs. Fryer also uses humor to elucidate his work. Well I work mainly in oils at the moment um, but I dabble in various things, um, sculpture, a little bit of sculpture, uh, I, I prefer mixed media, um, but mostly two-dimensional work, I would say. I like to use a lot of humor. I, th I find there's a lot of humor in African artwork, and the humor really attacks the audience, I would say. His work is currently being showcased in two of Cape Town's premier galleries, Yuri Sanjamela CGTN, Cape Town, South Africa.